Let's talk about succession. Succession is how plant communities like meadows and forests change over time. And especially after a big disturbance like a forest fire or big winds like here with all these blowdowns. Now we're on the East Ridge Trail about, what, 300 yards from the parking lot and just down the ridge from where the meadow starts now. So how do things happen in forests? Well, an ecosystem is an environment and the plants and animals that are adapted to that environment. So the thing about that is that environment constantly changes. So what's really important for the habitat for plants and animals? It's temperature, winter and summer, and moisture. When does the rain or snow come? And how much is there? And then there's the disturbance, whether it's fire, or it's wind, or it's drought, or it's people. So here, right on the side of the meadow, we had the forest, it blew down. So after the blowdown, what really changed? Well, there's how much sun is hitting the ground. There's when does the snow come? How long does it stay here? So these are the things that are going to control the habitat and the species, and they change all the time. Now, the species that are present can also affect the environment, but that's very slow by human standards. But on the edge, things can change really quick. And here, with the blowdown that happened, you can really see how things are responding. Now, some of these species are here because this forest, it was meadow a hundred years ago. But right now, the species that like the deep, dark forest, they're not favored here. The place now favors the species that can handle lots of sun and that can, that can respond really fast. And that's all these little things like the spring beauty or the violets. So here we see something that's changing and that is the one constant, particularly on the edges. So here's a question. What do you think is going to happen next? Succession, by the time your lives are where I am, what's it gonna be like right here?